Sometimes a good slurp is just the best. I made myself a Dalgona coffee for the first time in such a long time. And hi, welcome. <laughs> I feel like I don't know how to vlog anymore, even after just, you know, not vlogging for just over a week. I just ended the previous vlog, popped in a new be uh, memory card, and then I realized I have no full batteries. So I put a battery on charge. And then whilst I was waiting for that, I um, planned some content. So I have a lot going on right now and by a lot. I mean 12 different campaigns. Oh my goodness, that is insane. I literally cannot, like one person, I can't believe that. I started like organizing my things a little bit differently last night. I started doing it on my Google Calendar rather than just having it in my diary because I just feel like it's all over the place. I have to skip forward pages to see the following days. And I just feel like it's a little bit easier to like, you know, put things into different colors and just see different colors and just my mind works like that. You know, I love seeing like visuals. I think I have quite like a photographic memory. I like to like do more creative things so my mind works in that way so i'm gonna get started on this content the weather is a little bit weird today but we're gonna make it work as i said in my previous video i'm not gonna allow for any more setbacks i'm just gonna like work with it and just like do my best because i have no time to waste so i'm working on another campaign with vaseline we're doing some exciting bits um the last few weeks of summer and then we have a winter campaign planned as well and then i have something really exciting with clicks but yeah let me not tell you and bore you with this information any further let me just bring you along on the behind the scenes and yeah i'm just i feel like i needed like a couple of days to just regroup and like get my mind right again because younger jess that just you know finished her degree or was finishing her degree living at home wished she had a space to call her own and so that she can do her own thing film her content and just do what she, you know what she loves and i'm here I'm here sometimes you just need a little bit of time yes we are overwhelmed we have a lot to do but we can do it like we're equipped for this we are strong we have an amazing mindset we have um, god-given talent and we have motivation from so many different areas in our lives and support from different areas in our lives and um, yeah we can do it I'm excited to do it and I get to do it if you change the have to to get to you'll be amazed what it does for you so I really hope you enjoy this vlog with me I'm gonna get started and show you some behind the scenes and if it's what you want, I'm gonna give it to you yeah. promise I'm gonna give it to you Miss that smile Lord knows I ain't seen that in a while but it's your style so something must be up keeping you down you a queen that must be heaven sent Pray my soul I must repent for not telling you what I meant and how I felt Honestly I'm used to throwing wishes in a well My conscience tells me that I could have helped without fail Actions speak louder than words and that's a lesson that I learned all by myself Let him know, I gotta let him know Hello, it's a new day I have sock, a sock in my hair I'll show you exactly why. <laughs> I've been doing my little sock curls and I've been loving them. So yeah, it's a new day. I've been like filming non-stop this week. I'm just like a little busy body. This morning, however, I took a little bit of time to just like 
go through everything and just, you know, see what I have and, you know, I've been making some mistakes with formatting wrong cards and it's just because I have so much going on so I just took a little bit of time to just like, you know, see what I have, see what I still have to do, um, just like I did in the beginning of the video, like trying to get my schedule order, um, like organized. I kind of went deep into it and, you know, made sure that I know exactly what I need to do within each and every single project. So I did that and I edited a vlog. I did, um, yeah, so many things. I'm hungry now. So I was thinking of making something and like eating it with you because it's like a viral thing. And I did like a little hairstyle with my socks. I've been doing my, my hair heatless like this. So... Um, I will like maybe blow dry my hair and then like curl the ends and then this was like maybe like third day hair. I think I, I think I washed my hair on Tuesday. It's Friday today. So like halfway between washing, like after washing and the new wash, um, I will do these heatless curls. So I literally take a sock and I like put it around the sock. Dry hair, I just use like a little bit of like spray. I use the Moroccan oil. This is the leave-in conditioner. You can also use water and I really like the way it came out. I'm gonna just pull my hair back and we can make something to eat. You can see I'm a little bit tired. <laughs> so, welcome to my fridge. This is not I don't know where to put these things. It's like mayonnaise that has like one tablespoon in it. I have like half of this left. We have some croutons and then just like other things that are nearly done. But I keep like all of my like bottles in there. I rearranged the fridge yesterday. And I have like a bunch of like fresh fruits. So I have a pomegranate. I already like de-seeded it yesterday and then... I started eating it and I couldn't stop. So I need to do that again. I have blueberries. I have blackberries. And I'm pretty sure that you'll be able to guess what I'm going to make. And I have coconut water. So yeah, I'm going to be making the nature's cereal that you all have been seeing on TikTok. And can I just say that... This is probably the most expensive cereal ever because I paid 50 Rand for like two pomegranates. You won't use two, but yeah. And then like this little container of blueberries. I like ate half of it this morning with my breakfast. By the way, I've been obsessed with is it Wheata picks or we just call it wheat picks? Um with like berries and like honey on top of it. So that's what I had this morning and then yeah 42 43 rand for this and then blackberries 31 coconut water for this little can the only place i could find blueberries i literally took the last one i, t I even took like a little video for tiktok so that i can show i took the very last one i couldn't even find it woolies like it's that ridiculous and then yeah this coconut water was like 20 rand so this was like 150 rand but it's kind of bougie so i really wanted to try it and i've been like holding myself back to not try it because i wanted to try it with all of you and see what the hype is about so i'm gonna do my pomegranates first i've cut this open to show you how pretty this is it's literally like nature's gems but i think i have enough for um, just like a little taster because I have to leave in like 10 minutes. I'm just doing a little bit, like a handful of each ingredient, like each fruit, because you know, I have to go to the optometrist in literally like 12 minutes. <laughs> I actually want to go grab my phone so I can film a TikTok. <laughs> I really just wanted to like do this on TikTok as well. I'm not gonna say much. I'm just gonna. Okay, so I have my 
my fruit. pomegranates you definitely need the pomegranates mm. I put way too much coconut water I don't know this coconut water kind of just tastes like water I don't know the pomegranate seeds definitely bring out the taste of the coconut I wouldn't waste my money on the blackberries, if I was honest. <laughs> mm. Okay, I have my keys, my bag. My outfit and it's a mess behind me, so I'm not gonna show you. And yeah, we are gonna go to the optometrist. <laughs> couldn't see the bottom line so she could only see the second line and in her left eye so when I first you can now see the bottom line obviously yeah when I first saw you you couldn't see that whole screen you couldn't see that bottom line you could only see the what? second line in your right eye and in your left eye you could only see that bottom line <laughs> that's flippin scary if you have a blind fiance <laughs> Pretty is the sky. So beautiful. And I'm driving home because Ben is actually still working. Good morning, Leafies. So I'm back from the optometrist vision works in four ways they've actually um, you know been taking care of my eyes the wonderful Candice has been my eye doctor for like I would say like nearly like four years now yeah like three or four years and I'm really really excited and so proud to be working with them on a campaign they've obviously like you know taking care of my eyes i have a couple of like prescriptions from them i buy my contacts from them every single month and i'm just i'm so excited to be working with them on like a content piece so candice has sent me home with a couple of frames to like do a little bit of a outfit you know those videos that i've been doing with revlon the like nail to outfit inspo i'm gonna do the same glasses to or like specs to outfit inspo so i've selected a couple of um frames in the showroom and i'm gonna show you what they look like on so i have two mo ones over here and mo is actually um like exclusive to vision works so i have can't even remember <laughs> i'm gonna open them up i got a couple of um different frames you know to match the outfits that i know i have so i have oh my goodness this is so cute i have a little like orange tortoise and then how pretty for like an all neutral outfit how cute for like an all neutral outfit i think these ones are gonna look so cute and then we have a little bit more of a like funkier piece oh my gosh i actually love this it's a little bit like grandma-esque because <laughs> the frame is quite big but i don't know i like it i feel like it suits my skin tone quite well and this hairstyle <laughs> so we have those and then we have two vogue pairs they are identical we have like a red one 
and then I have like a purple outfit like this that will be absolutely perfect I just made the bed sprayed my little wrinkle releaser so the wrinkles and creases will be gone just now but how pretty I love 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 I'm not one for like colored specs but I know like especially like Brain's mom she loves like her colored frames she actually has purple ones I must send her a picture of these ones because I feel like she will love them so I have the red oh this purple is so complimentary i don't know why i even like that red i feel like you know to match your outfit if you want to be that bougie i mean we're we're matching our masks baby come kijk hoe gaan jy brille we're matching our masks to our outfits <laughs> so why not match like your spec frames to an outfit hey he has his earphones in Come see my specs. Yeah, I said it gives like your mom vibes because yeah. your mom loves like her purple, purple mm. specs, even the red ones. It's quite cute, huh? I said we're matching our like masks to our outfit, so why not do it for the frames? <laughs> I love it. So I'll have to send Brain's mom a picture of these. Maybe she'll end up like ordering a new pair of specs or maybe we'll actually like get her some new eyes <laughs> and then we have uh i don't know how to pronounce this but bollen then we have two sissy boy ones i like switched this one around because it was like upside down and my ocd was killing me and then we have a mew mew pair so let's start with the mew mew first of all oh my goodness so bougie love 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 the packaging it's like a little suede case so i actually have like maybe two of my specs are tortoise or one but not like this like out there kind of tortoise is it focusing these are obviously not like to my eyes i have my contacts in right now so it's just purely to shoot content and then i'm just gonna send them back so i'm not gonna keep all of these but i actually really like this it's quite like chic like an all black outfit i love the fact that the frame is kind of like cut off like right at the bottom i don't know you'll have to let me know which one is your favorite so those are the mew mew ones and then we have the sissy boy so we have two frames one is in a black box and one is in a beautiful kind of gives me like tiffany style they also have tiffany i believe so um yeah these ones are kind of like a take on the ones that i have like the clear frames but let me put it next to the white so you can actually see it has like a mauve tint to it and the ears or i think i think they call it temples of the frame is like a little tortoise design you know i love my tortoise so it's like a cat eye and i wanted to pick these because i have like clear frames and i know candice <laughs> loved these two she was like convincing me to like update my specs with these ones and i think they look so pretty like you don't really notice the frame that much because it's a lighter color but i also wanted to mention like for example the clear frames are so in right now i do think that you need to pay attention to your skin tone and what it looks like on your skin tone so for example the clear frame that i have from mo like the brand mo from vision works is like a pure clear so i believe like on darker skin tones it will look very white and like like too noticeable whereas this one would blend into the skin very beautifully but i do think that both frames obviously go really well i feel like this one is very suitable to like any skin tone because it has like a different look on everyone if that makes sense so on me it looks like a little bit more of a camely color obviously because of my pale skin tone but i believe on like a darker skin tone it'll look like a true nude to them because obviously nude is different to each of us so i got this one and i actually really love it it's so comfortable 
I don't know. I love a cat eye. A cat eye is so cute. And then this one gives me like Tiffany vibes, although it is sissy boy. It also has a little bit of a cat eye, but I don't know. It's a little bit more of a retro, but still like girly frame. It's very, very subtle. Like honestly, so incredibly subtle. It's not like blue in your face. That's why I really like it. And then um, it has like silver silver detailing and just has like the sissy boy on the side and then the last one is the one i can't really pronounce bollen trying to like open these boxes very very gently because i'm obviously gonna send them back Ooh, these are one of my favorites the clear frames <laughs> loving the clear frames this one i'm gonna put it next to the white again so you can see this one has like a little bit of a like rose gold kind of rosy nude and then it fades into like this goldeny clear so i really love this one it has the like branding on the side and then i don't know if you can see that but it has like a little rose gold metal part going through like the clear bit i love the ombre i think it really suits my personal skin tone quite well i don't know i really like it i like the shape i like it's not cat eye it's not round it's not square it's just very comfortable on the eye but i think this one and comparing it with this one kind of helps me explain like the skin tone and clear frames a lot better because this one for example is a little bit more rosy and a little bit more like golden at the bottom and a bit more warm which suits my skin tone quite well but this one is like a little bit more like tanned if that makes sense so i think with clear frames definitely like go as close to your skin tone as possible if that's like the look you are trying to go for because obviously clear frames are meant to look kind of invisible but then obviously you still have specs on to me i love it because when i'm editing i don't really see the frame like when you walk around and everything sometimes my eyes get tired with a black frame so i like switch them up but with like you know more neutral frames and clear frames they're a lot kinder to the eye why am i keeping these glasses on but yeah i love all of these please let me know which one is your favorite i can't wait to like share my outfit videos and like outfit pics matching these frames and i'm really excited to be working with vision works in four ways she is honestly candice is honestly like my eyes have never been better and my eyes I did my checkup my eyes actually got better how crazy is that so this one um used to be a lot weaker than this one but this one is actually like catching up to the other one so my prescription is like minus one minus 1 1.5 and it's now minus one minus 1.25 i think so um yeah it's 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 getting better i honestly don't know what i did before she actually showed me how I saw before and I just couldn't believe it. Like, I don't know how I functioned without proper vision, but I'm just so incredibly happy to be in good hands. I highly recommend going there, like checking your eyes, just making sure that you have good eye health and that you are seeing properly because I promise you, life is meant to be seen. And if you don't see properly it's just like for example when we went paragliding um like over a year ago i couldn't believe that i could literally like see the people walking like in the streets and like people on the beach and i just it's just life is so much better with clear eyesight and i'm really excited to be working with them i'm gonna pack all of these away and like start matching them up with my outfit i'm not going to show you this um like content creation in this vlog but i am going to show you what i'm going to do for the rest of the day i have two con content pieces that i want to film for l'oreal that is due one is for hair 
I'm gonna show you this box. It is stunning. And then I'm doing a makeup one a little bit later, like just a general brand one for L'Oreal. And then yeah, we can make dinner a little bit later on. So let's enjoy the rest of the day. You've told me more than once to show you my intention. My brain gets blocked at times, but now somehow I'll give you my attention. You've got to know that I. Okay, so <laughs> I got this delivery from L'Oreal on Saturday and they included the, that massive box with all of these roses, but they didn't have any water and I couldn't like film at the time. It is Tuesday now, by the way, it's like a couple of days later. Then Friday, obviously, um, I did the previous vlog. I did like a little weekend vlog, as you saw. Um, but yeah, I got all of these roses in that box and I didn't want them to die. So yeah, I put them in like little glasses, little cups. There's like more at the back. And now I'm going to take all of them out. It literally took me a couple of days to like find dry ice. <laughs> I didn't know it was a mission like that to find dry eyes, but yeah, some of them are starting to like, you know, go a little bit floppy and like some of them are getting some brown spots. So I obviously want them to be nice and fresh for the video, but I struggle to find dry eyes because I'm doing a campaign with L'Oreal Steam Pod and I was working with Philips. Um, October, November, December and L'Oreal Steam Pod reached out to me and unfortunately I couldn't work with L'Oreal Steam Pod because obviously um, if you work with like one brand even though it's like a completely different product sometimes you can't work with all of the brands that you want to and even though I use like different hair products and different hair tools all the time and I really really wanted to work with L'Oreal with the steam pod I couldn't and just look now I get to do it how crazy and how exciting is that so things do end up like they're supposed to at the end of the day so I'm gonna take all of these roses out and then put them in the box and then I found dry eyes yesterday so I'm gonna like pop it in so that it looks like steam, you know? I'll be there if you reach out to me. does look what he does just show the lippies voila dry ice oh my goodness oh yes yes
nearly dinner time, but I'm hungry. We haven't had lunch. I got a sushi from John Dory. literally had like the smallest dinner after the sushi we didn't have much because yeah it was quite filling and we were just so busy like working late we have so much going on at this very moment and there's so much i want to update you on so i will do like a little life update in one of the next vlogs <laughs> just like catch you up to speed but a lot of things um aren't like a done deal yet and there's so many things that's still like a work in progress before I'm able to like share it but it's gonna be really exciting and like a lot of vlog opportunities so I'll kind of like share that with you as it unfolds but yeah this was kind of like a working <laughs> working days vlog with me and just like filming some content so I hope you enjoyed it I'm really really excited to work with vision works and I'm gonna go edit some of that content right now brain actually just did my hair so I'm gonna go edit that right now as well so as you saw like the unboxing with the L'Oreal steam pod in this vlog I'm gonna do like a video where he actually does my hair and we just filmed that so yeah I'm gonna wrap up this vlog I'm so excited to share so much more with you in the upcoming vlogs so please stick around and then I will see you in the next one Mwah! bye ladies love you so much Bye.